one. Let's go. Let's go. You are about to experience the uncensored conversations, stimulating wit, and the thought-provoking wisdom. Bold, raw, and uncut. Right now, on the Lance Curve Show. There was a concert earlier today, and it was a terrorist attack there. And um, it was in the Manchester Arena, an explosion, 19 dead. And I don't have all the facts, but I think 50 others were injured. And um, what's the young lady's name? Let me see. I'm, I'm right here. I just actually got in from outside. Oh, Ariane, Ariana Grande is her name. Is it? Is that how you pronounce it? Blue Star? Blue Star. Welcome, man. Um, Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yes. Man, let me tell you something. You are, not were, but are, and always have been on point. And in the, the, in the last show that we did, which was really our first show, but it was our last big conversation, uh, you spoke about the month of May being a very bloody month. That is correct. And um, here it is. Okay, as I spoke of, and it's not for me to be right or me to be the person that I'm like, hey, look, everyone. It's the, bo the bottom line is, I told you, May 1st, May Day. This is where these people organized what was going to happen to you, and they have to also honor the sacrifices, what they have dealt with. Okay, these people have come in and signed these declarations of independence and all the other great so-called constitutional rights on May 1st in Pennsylvania, okay, which is actually boiled down to what you see now. And like I told you before, May Day is May Day. Okay, when someone yells out May Day, it doesn't mean like, hooray for me, it's a problem. And guess what comes into the same month? It's Memorial Day. Why yeah. do we have that? Why do we have that? Mm -hmm. okay, it's something easy for everyone to pay attention to. It's not the thing of, hey, I want to be right. No, it's something that you guys need to be adjusted to and say, hey, guess what? We're not under that agenda due to the fact this is what you have been trained from. Right. Little first grade from a kid on a barbecues, nonsense, and being misled. It's not anger. It's not for stupidity, understanding, and being able to stop these things from happening. You have the power. Remember, the people have the power. And you have the spiritual power. You have all the power. Mm. As, you, as you, as people will jump up, and as you do see, which we're going to go into later on, which it will not be tonight, right. unfortunately, sheep are led to slaughter. <laughs> yeah. no, matter, no matter which way you cut it. Right. Sheep are led to slaughter. You're going to lead a sheep to take its fur. You're going to take its little meat. You're going to take everything from the sheep. Okay, so when someone says, my pastor, my flock, and my sheep, guess what you're under? Okay, mm. don't, don't, whistle, don't think about me and say, hey, this is what I say. Think about it. These things are too easy. Please, everyone, be conscious of what's going on. If you don't have to think about it, dive into it, or be a fool or afraid, think. Just look and listen. And finally, understand. All you have to do is understand. I can, someone can talk to me all day long, and I can listen to everything they say. But if I don't understand what they're saying, it went right out the window. It went right out the window. We talked about May Day, May 1st, yes. what's going to happen in the month of May, and look what happened in the month of May. Mass bloodshed. How could this be? We could point out other days, other months again, that, that you're going to see the same exact thing. And guess what's going to happen? The same thing. These things that, okay, you know, people say, hey, I want to look at this, or I want to find out about Egyptian this, or I want to find out about, hey, guess what? You're talking about you now and this. Okay, you're not talking about biblical things. We can always talk about biblical things, and we can dissect that, which, unfortunately, some people are going to be disappointed, and they don't want to give up the, the fact of, hey, I may have been misled all my life. It's good to feel good. It's good to feel the spirit rise in your body and in your soul, but find out what spirit is rising and, and coming up in your body and in your soul. Mm -hmm. Okay? 
Um, my thing is with anyone, okay, emotions are always being played, and emotions are being played in church, and no matter what you look at, you can look at a commercial, they're going to put the same music, little things to make you drop a tear, adopt a puppy, or look out for this, and you're going to feel good, your heart's going to open up. Boom. It's emotions. It's about your spirit and your power and your life. Once you see over that kind of thing, you're going to know deception and the rest. I appreciate this small amount of time that we have to talk. There's going to be more of this, and it's going to be better. And it's not promotional anything. There's nothing to promote with anything. It's about, please, everyone start becoming conscious of what's going on before it's way too late. That's right. When it's way too late, there's nothing. Like I told everyone before, hindsight is not always the best sight. Hindsight is not always the best sight. I remember someone told me, hey, look, dude, on this boulevard, they have a detour saying turn left. And then if me trying to be cute and not worry about it, I'm going to go uh, the, in the opposite direction. And guess what's going to happen? I'm going to crash. That's right. I'd rather know what's coming versus later on finding out as I'm in cuff or doomed or in another position where you don't want to be. Everyone, please be responsible, be grown, don't be fooled anymore. You don't have to move fast with it. You, people don't realize moving slow helps you understand and get things better versus mm-hmm. trying to rush through everything. Okay, if someone says rush through a test, you're going to try to do whatever you do, and then next thing you know, what are you going to do? You're going to start marking anything. Okay, blah, 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 time's running out. It's only 10 minutes, and I'm going to do this. <laughs> and that, those things aren't that. Next thing you know, you, you forgot what you were there for to do. You were there to take a test. Okay, you studied hard, you know the answers, but since they put a time limit, now you're rushing. Yeah. Now you're rushing. Hey, you got three minutes left. Oh, oh man, I'm, I'm behind. And you're looking at other students. They, some of them are sitting up like, I'm done. Some of them are <laughs> looking like, I'm, I'm not done. You're looking like, I'm way behind. And now you're just trying to put anything. Don't put anything in front of you or in your mind or in your life. Anything is something that doesn't exist. Anything. That's anything. Hey, what would you like to eat tonight? Anything. Guess what? I'll bring you some dog food. Are you going to eat it? The answer would be no. Mm. That's anything. These are anything. Don't put anything in front of you and say, hey, guess what? I'm going to deal with it. Those aren't, that's not realistic. You got, everyone is too, almost everyone and when I say almost, I mean like 99% is too important to be diving into anything, 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 holding anyone's hand, being with anything, going with any program. Anything is nothing. The truth is the truth, and nonsense is exactly what it is. <laughs> So as I'm going to close this right now, and I appreciate everyone's time. Yes. We're going to put this very hard, and we're going to put this on the map. Hey, everyone, listen up. Anyone that wants to know what really needs to be done and what you really need to do, I have a lot of answers for you. And it's not by reading or faking or pulling something up from someone else's stuff. That's not realistic. I am me, and I do have answers. I don't have all the answers, but I have the ones that will probably project you to where you can be the person that gives the ultimate answers and help more than what I can do. But you have to be here, and you have to understand. You have to listen, and you have to comprehend. It's not trickery. There's no trickery with me because there's no purpose for me to trick anyone. This this is not real. So please, we're going to set this up again. I love everybody that wants to do good and know good, and all the divinity is in your heart. Do right. Don't let anybody turn you into something you are not, no matter what's going on. I don't care what's going on in your life. If you stick to you and say, I'm not folding and turning myself to be ugly, you're going to win, and you're going to win immediately. Like I said, divinity does not let you down. 
no matter which way anyone cuts it. It doesn't let you down. You you be like, holy smoke, my stomach almost touched the ground. But guess what? You did it touch the ground, and you bounce right back up just like a bungee cord. You come right back up, boom, and you're going to win. Don't let anything take you to the hole. Thank you, Blue Star, and I appreciate all of your time. Thank you, Sir Lance. Make sure to check out the boldest blog at landscurve.com and follow Scurve on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube under Lance Scurve.